things around your neck is not usually a good practice. Yeah, that's why they say that in The Incredibles. No capes! Yeah. She, she's like, no capes! Guys, it's like this. No capes! <laughs> because there was a girl who looked at an airplane's window while flying and then and then fell to the ground. And then another one, which is this one, the boy, and the, yeah, his cape was blowing him into a portal of air. Yeah, let's go put your shoes on, honey. Is that the good spot, Sadie? Uh-huh. I look at the sun and the sun is shining down right here. And warming my chalk for me. Thank you. <laughs> watch out, don't. All right, pluck it. It is all timber framing all day long here for the next little bit. We are in our summer mode. I've heard it said before that for homesteaders or for country people, spring is for planting, summer is for building, fall is for the harvest, and winter is for rest. And we have moved out of our springtime planting and into our summertime building. Dad's building a shop for his supplies and building projects and um it has six trusses he's built one of them and he's shaping the pieces for another one that will be a family snack we have prepared a beautiful snack for you yeah is it donuts no <laughs> oh okay but it's something really it's homegrown radishes okay. from my garden. Very nice. That's way better than donut. <laughs> I don't know. Radishes are good. Not better than donuts. Oh, I don't know. That's no, they're words. spicy. That's nice. Stella grew them all by herself. Good job, baby. Thanks. Stella's garden is different from the other two gardens because Stella is a different kid from the other two kids. She picked out the most fertile soil that anybody has, which is this place where the goats were last year. And she set out her vegetables in little plots with signs. No uh, mixing and matching for her. She likes to know what's what. And she is already getting a yield. <laughs> so since we pulled up a bunch of my radishes, they were big and tall and their red was showing, so it was time to pull them up. We're gonna go plant some more. These are early potatoes, 
And this is her radish bed. And she's got I need to take off my gloves. Doesn't... Marigolds and some basil. And her carrots are actually not doing very well because of all of this lush growth, also known as weeds. Um, she's got a lot of grass growing in here, but she's got a few carrots. Oh, there's a few I missed. Sadie, what are you going to do now? Um, paint some ends of some boards. We finished cutting and smoothing this rafter. Now Sadie's going to put the wax on the end. Over here, honey. So it's just that, do you see the difference between the end grain? See how, mm -hmm. see how the, um, so the tree's like a big straw right yeah. like a straw in a drink what's its drink um, the water from the earth right yeah so it's stuck in the earth and it's drinking water that way and this is the direction of the straw right yeah. so we need to plug the ends of the straw so that if there's water in here it stays in there for a while okay so this is the end, that's the end, right, and you can just do all of that. Yep, lay it right flat on that surface, and you flip it over and get that stuff on there too. It can be kind of thick, okay? What's up? I need this cut. Okay. I need to make two pieces because I need to cut there, there, and there. So oh, I see. I'll That's my best drawing of a watermelon. That's about what ours are going to look like. They won't be big like the ones at the grocery store. You try and get it in the corner and then smear it out. In the corner and smear it out. And then you flip your brush because that's what the side that's loaded. In the corner, smear it out. In the corner, smear it out. The only wood in the whole wide world is trees. Each truss is made up of um, three pieces. There's the tie beam that goes across, and then the rafters that go diagonally up and they connect somewhere in there. And Dad's finished both of the rafters and now he's working on the tie beam. Tomorrow we're gonna put it together. So this is a um, rafter, 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 tie beam, and then the big thing is, mm -hmm. okay. So we've got a rafter, a rafter, a tie beam. Does that work for you? Perfect. And then we have rafter, rafter, tie beam not assembled. I didn't get to help with the first truss, but I get to help with the second one. Do you think it'll be fun? Maybe.
at my little house. Good night. I'm not Bob Marley. <laughs> <laughs> That's why I Do you remember it. when we taught him to say, what did we teach him to say when he was really little? Something. I am a robot. <laughs> we taught him to I say. I worked on that one for a long time, but he. I am a robot. <laughs> Something Marlon Brando. <laughs> what? Oh, uh, you had a, you had a voice that you were playing with that sounded like a famous actor who's got kind of a funny voice. Marlon Brando? Yes. Yeah, when you were Marlon really Brando. little. I mean, we're talking three years old. You were little. And you were doing a funny voice, sort of. What did it sound like? Don't make me do more. <laughs> do it! Do it! But do it's the it. famous... Uh, it's. He was in the movie version of the play that Stella is named after, and it's super famous, and he screams, Stella! You told me about it before. If you yeah. were in So it's that guy. But what did we make him say? I could have been a contender. Yep. <laughs> that one? I could have been somebody. <laughs> Remember. No capes!